We love liquid nitrogen here at Beal Science. I've come out to the garage because we're going to try a couple things. Now, I'm going to take a bunch of liquid nitrogen and dump it into the hot tub. Before we go outside, let me show you why we're doing this on a little smaller scale. So right here, I've got hot water, right? That's going to be my pseudo little, over there, I'm making a mess. My pseudo little hot tub. And then I've got the liquid nitrogen. Now, liquid nitrogen is minus 320 degrees Fahrenheit. That's cold, really cold. And instantly, even at 20 degrees air temperature out here, it's going to boil because it's past its boiling point. It's heating up too much. But if we let it interact with water, now it's going to heat up even more quickly. This water is about 100 degrees. You ready for this? I'm just going to pour a little bit in. We'll see how it goes. Look at this, huh? That's that liquid nitrogen instantly vaporizing into nitrogen gas. You can see it going all over. You see it in the thermal pretty good? Now, so imagine this. Imagine this right here in the hot tub when we've got that minus 320 liquid nitrogen going down in that hot, hot, hot 100 degree water. Bam! We're gonna have a disaster on our hands. But you know, that's kind of what we're looking for. I got one more thing I wanna try. Now, I'm gonna fill up this carboy. Well, this is uh, one of those water jugs. You know, you see at the water cooler, people standing around at the office, visiting, hanging out. And all that fog that built up last time, that nitrogen gas, should come shooting right out of the top of this thing. At least that's what I'm hoping is gonna happen. Now, here's the problem. When I go to pour this in there, it's gonna come shooting out of the top and it's gonna push the water right back out. So I've got a water bottle here. I'm gonna put the roughly 100 degree water inside. Should be able to see that in the thermal, can you? Woo! And I'm just gonna jet this in there. There you go, going in. Just a little dribble at first. See it coming out of the top? Let's go with more. I wasn't joking when I said winter arrived. Look at the poor old hot tub. It is covered up with the snow, but we're gonna clear it off. We're gonna dump a bunch of water in here and find out what it is gonna look like. Hundred and one degrees. Negative three hundred and twenty degrees. Combining. Ice crystals forming on the top. That's yeah, pretty cool. There you go. Come over here. Now I got the jets going. 
I got a little bit left. Got it circulating good. Woo! Excellent. Hey, well, let's finish it up. Like I said, I love liquid nitrogen. But there's a lot of other great science experiments that we love over here at Beale Science. You can't even see me in that fog. And if you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. Maybe you leave us a comment. Tell us what you think. Give us an idea for another experiment. Maybe with liquid nitrogen, maybe not. Maybe uh, I should get a sponsor so I can buy a new hot tub. My wife doesn't kill me when this one's officially froze up. But you know what? The point of all this is to remind all of you to keep on learning.